married me. So, I covered a little bit about Atlantis. Some of you have been doing your research and doing a very good job too. Yes, it is found in, uh, in the Bermudan Triangle and it's on the southerly point of Cuba. That's where they found the evidence, evidence of Atlantis. Um, the beings of Atlantis were were to bring a new science to teach man horticulture, agriculture, to teach man to live. Flying machines were they did have uh, vidmanas. We'll, we'll call them for the sake of anything. How do these machines operate? They operated by sound frequency. Now this does not um, this does not surprise me because this is what we've been dealing with while, we've been, while I've been giving these lectures sound frequency. And they've also developed, I believe, now uh, they have developed engines that can travel, th that you can use in space, that use sound frequencies of a kind. These will propel a craft faster than the speed of light. These are developed. Make no mistake, they're here. So, in Atlantis they used these. It could also be used as a, sound frequencies they use as a weapon. Um, they could bring down a city by going to sub-level 7. If you go to, or sub-level 5, if you go to these levels it causes disturbance amongst rock and brick and it will crumble and weaken. Uh, many of you I've know the story of Jericho in, in your Bible, where they used trumpets which caused a deep resonance, which also brought the walls down. Jericho. So, this was common, commonly used. They also used sun rays and captured sun rays on these huge parabolic dishes. And they focused the sun rays as a weapon, burnt enemy ships with them. A, uh, a very, I was going to say a crude form of laser, but it was not, because the sun rays were focused through a crystal in the centre, like your uh, um, satellite dishes. You have um, uh, a little box in the front of your satellite dish, where they used the crystal. So the rays are developed. Now, if you doubt this, think of the laser. What does the laser use? It uses a ruby. It passes light through the ruby, through helium. And that is your laser. So, it's nothing very complicated. I mean, you're all using lasers, all of you. You've got CD players, what's it use? A laser. Bluetooth player on your television, what's it use? A laser. So there's nothing very surprising about this. They're a very advanced race. Now they have brought up, I believe, two statues. They brought this up in the 60s. And they reckon they were from Atlantis. Now, we're concentrating on Atlantis. What happened to all the people? When this great tsunami and this great disaster occurred through this great war that issued, what happened? Well, the star people left Atlantis. Except for one. And that one was Kuan Yin, as we know her. She wasn't called Kuan Yin then, of course. 
and the people were moved. Some of the people went to uh, um, what we now know as America. Some went to what we know as South America. You have parts of a land of this great continent still existing. It's called the bloody Caribbean. So, how far did this landmass stretch? Well, as far as we know, as by uh, research, it stretched as far into Ireland. Ireland was the last island. There was a part of that landmass. As I explained before, there was a belt of land right around the center, the the earth. Then, when they when the plates separated, after this great calamity, this great huge catastrophe occurred, everything separated. Well, what was the war? Let's have a look at it, this. The priests in Atlantis were infiltrated by um, uh, some very nasties. And they tried to persuade the priests that they should have full control and take over. Ra agreed with this because Ra was um, seems to run the whole shebang. But they were opposed by a more powerful force and they were forced off this world. Ra and all his entourage had to leave but a few of them stayed and mingled with the human beings. And because of that, they were so powerful, they could control. The other great god of this world is money. Because with money comes greed, with money comes killing, with money comes theft, with money comes disaster. Marriages have broke up over money. So they invented this currency. Remember, before there was currency, they had a barter system. But now it's this currency rubbish. A complete disaster. They talk about the democratic rights of a country. Democratic and dictator both start with D, and there's not much difference between them. Believe me, you're still slaves, and you're still bloody... Um, drones to those who control you and they have the they have the power of life and death so we find that some of them went to south america some of them went to north america but there was a lot that fled to egypt remember the continent was massive and it wasn't the only continent that sunk. It wasn't just this cup, this continent. Lumuria sunk. Mu sunk. Brittany sunk. All at the same time. The war was so vast between these two fractions. <coughs> so man... Man is still striving. We have the Atlanteans separated now into different places. Those who are interested, more interested in this, I advise you to go to the group Atlantis and watch some of the videos. They even infiltrated, um, oh, where is it? Uh, Shangri-La and Shambhala but it's the same place and it's, they tried to bring in the dark science or science of the dark ones into this era into Shangri-La 
which it took a long time to purify this and repel it. Again, look at Atlantis. Look at the videos that were put down. So where are these star people now? They are, they are coming. They are around us. The four-armed ones. They're big people. They're giants compared to us. They're Twelve foot. Four arms and high intelligence. The opposition, I'm not going to even discuss that. Because I think you know who the oppo opposition are. It's the Anunnaki. Man is becoming more and more enlightened. And as man becomes more enlightened, it becomes a threat to the Anunnaki. That means they will cause mass arrests and they will cause a lot of chaos. But still, more will become enlightened. But how, how long have I got, young man? You have two minutes. I have two minutes, folks. So, there's some strange noises going on in the, the other, in that room in there. Tricking. She's on the bloody phone or computer again. Tick, 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 She's tick. on the phone. Bro. She's got a new toy, folks. Let me tell, this is what all the, the problem is. She's got a new toy, the Galaxy 3. And she's gone loopy. Well, she's a woman, what do you expect? <laughs> so... <laughs> <coughs> thank you for your kind thoughts thank you for the healing that you've given us both we you are always in our thoughts Mary we have met Mary we part Mary we will meet again Om Shanti Namaste <laughs>